Look at this vibrant, colourful work. This is by Wallace Ting. He died in 2010 and this is quite typical of his style. Born in 1929, Wallace Ting was a Chinese-American artist who moved to Paris in 1952 and then to New York in 1957 where he forged a fantastic international artistic career. Wallace loved women, flowers, birds and animals and they all appeared in his artworks. He was a real bon vivant. He loved life, producing poetry, prose and he loved to dance and sing. His first works were typically, you could say, Chinese, monochromatic black and white paintings and sketches. Um, but when he moved to America, he was exposed to the abstract expressionists such as Jackson Pollock and the pop artists such as Andy Warhol. And so his artistic style quickly developed Developed. Ladies with Parrots is stylistic and vibrant and it's typical of his portfolio. Full of colourful and simplistic shapes, there's a primitive naivety to his work. It's almost like a childlike theatrical intensity to what he's looking at. In a way, his style is more akin to printmaking, more like Gauguin's primitive artworks where we see more flattened colours and more abstracted shapes. It's more about design and form and line. King is experimenting with abstraction. He's creating form with many daubs of paint, which when we look at the whole, come to create a composition. But his art was never classified as abstract art, unlike Pollock, and some see his work as primitivism. He has left hundreds of paintings and he forged a really successful artistic career in his life, producing many prints. His work was extremely commercial. He now features in the Centre Pompidou, in the Tate Modern, in Sotheby's, in the Guggenheim Museum, to name a few. So we can actually go and see his work. Next up, we're going to look at Hogarth, a British satirist. Don't forget to subscribe in this corner here.